What's up guys? Welcome to a new video. Today, I want to show you everything I eat. I want to prove to you guys that I eat 5,300 calories every single day. The way my diet works, generally most of my carbs are centered around my workout. However, because the carb content is like 750 grams, it's got to the point now where I kind of have carbs in most meals um, just because it's just physically impossible to eat so much. So uh, that'll explain why, for example, I'm about to have a couple of slices of bread. That like that'll explain why because the carb content is just completely overspilled. Um, but I just keep carbs minimal, so it's going to be two gram, uh, two slices of bread, which is going to be like 30 grams of carbs. So it's not really, it's not really that big when I'm not going to use it. Um, and also, I also get a free meal every single week um, that I can swap out. Um, I'm probably going to take one of those meals today if I can. Um, if we go into Shoreditch, I'll probably try and get something. Um, a free meal just consists of swapping out any of the meals um, for something that you want. Um, I always go for something very, very nutritious, very, very high carb. Um, so hopefully find something nice. So 5,300 calories, guys, coming at you. I'll keep the macros on screen. I'll keep the calories on screen. <sighs> Hope you guys are ready to see some big eating today. Breakfast consists of four rashes of bacon. Guys, bacon is not on my plan, but it's one of those days that I said I could have those meals, so I decided I'm gonna swap out two things, but So four slices of bacon, two slices of bread, five eggs. <clears throat> These are large eggs, guys, as well, the farm eggs. Um, free range farm eggs. They're super, super nice, so they're quite all right to get in. They're not quite on the 10 eggs of Keith Chi. Hashtag Keith Chi 10 eggs. Uh, this equates to 1,121 calories. Um, so, meal one, 1,122 uh, 21 calories, 41 grams of carbs, 65 grams of fat, and 89 grams of protein. So, this is a very, very heavily um, a heavy fat meal. I really only have fat in the morning once with my salmon meal. Um, which I've actually swapped out for beef now, so once on my beef meal, forgot about that. Um, and then at the end of the night, I have 40 grams of peanut butter. It's again, a little bit more fat, so 65 grams may seem like a fuckload for one meal, considering I'm eating 5,300 calories. I think that's pretty good um, in terms of fat as well, especially when the carbs are so, so, so high. So let me tuck into this, guys. Um, we're probably gonna head into Shoreditch, get a coffee, and I'm gonna try and get one of those meals if I can, if these eggs don't fucking kill me. So, let's see. Got him in his natural habitat. Boom cycle, Mr. Boom. Mr. Boom cycle. He gets busy for For a fat boy, 96 kilos on the dot today. No, 96.7 kilos today. Still got abs. Still got abs. I'm called the recanting. I told that bitch to call me. Danny Brown, bitch. Tell me what you need. Nay, I got some mad roll and fire your ass weed. They try to tell me. Guys, this is the secret that I was telling you about the ground rice. So it's literally just like a fine powder. It's much, much easier on the stomach than oats will be. Uh, so normally I had 90 grams of oats pre-workout. Now I have 90 grams of pre-workout. Uh, pre 90 grams of pre-workout, Jesus. 
90 grams of ground rice um, it's pretty much straight carbs it's gonna be about 65 70 grams of carbs um, and then I'm gonna put 40 grams of honey on top um, yes honey because it's just more carbs pretty much um, and then I have 50 grams of protein from whey um, I told you guys that my stomach was hurting from whey I've been trying it here and there just I tend to just go down to one shake a day of whey and the rest of it I'll use that vegan stuff that I was telling you about so I'm gonna try a whey on right now and hopefully my stomach doesn't hurt so yeah, meal two. Um, I'll give you the calories and macros after. Guys, I'd like to say. I don't know how to make this shit. So this is just like hard, lumpy, ricey tasting stuff. This is not gonna be very enjoyable, but gains are gains, gotta get them in. So there's 678 calories in this next meal. Uh, 111 grams of carbs. 4 grams of fat and 54 grams of protein. I might as well take you through my intra workout while we're here. So during my workout, I drink um, an intra workout drink, which consists of BCAs along with um, highly branched cyclic or cyclic dextrin. I'm going to say cyclic. Cyclic, yeah. Highly branched cyclic dextrin, which is just a very, very fast absorbing carb. Um, Essentially, the most catabolic you're going to be is while you're working out because you're using all the energy and it's funneling your workout rather than funneling staying anabolic. So it's the best time to eat. So I have a couple scoops of, at the moment I've got BSN aminos, which works out about 120 calories of just pure protein because it's BCAs. Um, and then 380 calories worth of highly brent cyclic dextrin, which is 100 grams. So, pretty intra workout. So, bearing in mind, guys, I've just had 111 grams of carbs pre workout, or I'm about to. In an hour, when I start working out, I'm going to have 97 grams of carbs, which is 100 grams of cyclic dextrin. And then I'm going to have 30 grams of protein during my workout. During. So, that's 500 calories during my workout. Um, so you might see how it turns a little bit easy to get all this all these carbs in because the cyclic dextrin is very very light on the stomach. I'll be back. Maybe I'll show you a little snippet of the workout right here. Nigga, we made it. Hey. We made it. Nigga, we made it. Hey. Damn, we made it. Nigga, we made it. Hey, we made it. Hey, nigga, we made it. Okay, guys, it is ten past seven. We've got a lot of food to eat. Um, this meal is one chicken breast consisting of 200 grams of chicken. Um, I do one packet of Uncle Ben's rice. Don't judge me guys. It's perfect with these Uncle Ben's is exactly the amount of carbs I need. So there's about 69 carbs in the rice. Um, I think it's about, it works out about 100 grams dry. Um, so this is lemon and coriander with just like a sweet chili chicken breast. Um, I am then gonna have 130 grams of Frosties after. I know I said I'll get rid of the Frosties but they're never ending, so 130 grams of Frosties after this. And then I've got another meal coming after that. Oh, fuck. That meal just never gets easier. I'm so fucking bloated right now. The good thing is, I because the carbs are so simple with the Frosties, they do digest pretty quickly. So I'm hoping in half an hour, an hour, I'm hungry again, and I can have my my next meal. We're currently sitting around three and a half thousand calories, I think. But push on up, push it on up. Most of my calories always come post workout, just because you don't really need them pre workout because I'm not going to use them for anything. You know what? I'm going to give you a better back shot than earlier in the changing rooms. So we definitely got the width there. I, one thing I'm really pleased on this year is just the thickness that I've come through with. I mean, I feel like you can see my traps and my rear delts really thick through there. Granted, holding a lot of body fat, but 
still still got abs bleed still there so 96 kilos guys still got abs Guys, I don't count vegetables into my plan at all, so you can just completely disregard this. Sweet potato, 500 grams. That's for later. I'm gonna eat this meal. Probably have the peanut butter get a little sweet tooth done, because it's like the coconut almond one. And then come back and have the half a kilo of potato. And then... Sorry. And then sorry. So it's hard, man. It's like, it's like half an hour, half past nine. I'm full. 200 grams of 5% beef. Two plain white wraps. 200 grams of fake yogurt. Meal four, five, if you include the interest. Snack. Half a kilo of potato. Half a kilo. Sweet potato. Oh, because you went out to the cash machine. Oh, yeah. Right, guys. That is all of my meals consumed. Um, let's get a full weigh-in of what everything was. So give or take a few calories, because you never know with my fitness pal, probably up to 100, I'd say. No more than 150. Having walked 10,000 steps today, I consumed 5,398 calories. Of those calories, 337 came from protein. That's all types of protein, not just pure, um, not just complete proteins. 705 grams of carbs. It speaks for itself. It can safe to say that my glycogen stores are full right now. Um, and then finally, 137 grams of fat. That was definitely on the high side because I had a few more scoops of peanut butter than I should have done. But we're bulking guys, so it's not the biggest deal in the world. Um, Definitely doesn't get easier. Like like I said earlier, I still get just as full. I just get hungrier quicker, so. Swings and roundabouts, swings and roundabouts. Um, that's pretty much it for the four day of eating, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. It's gonna come out soon. I'm gonna hold you to it, hold myself to it. Today is the 21st of February. Coming out soon. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, guys. Peace. Get it, get it, come on now. Jeez! Oh, don't. It's gonna fuck it up. Jeez! Lost the hat though. Oh yeah, how about that? I got my pie. I got my pie. How about it? <laughs>